Hello, I'm Rancho Palos Verde City Manager R. Moranian with an update from the October 1st City Council meeting. The RPV City Council and community received an encouraging update on the ongoing landslide crisis that has wreaked havoc for months. The city geologists reported that the land movement is showing signs of slowing. Data shows since August, the overall average rate of movement in the Portuguese Bend landslide complex has decelerated by 13% to 8 inches per week. The recent activation of six deep vertical dewatering wells is removing over 700 gallons of water per minute to relieve water pressure that is fueling the slide. As for the funding, the council voted to allocate $10,000 in individual financial assistance to impacted property owners in the Portuguese Bend Community Association, Seaview, and Portuguese Bend Beach Club neighborhoods. The funds come from $5 million in assistance from the Office of LA County Supervisor Janice Hahn and the remaining money will be used for the city's landslide response and stabilization efforts. The council voted on allocating nearly $14 million in various funding to mitigate the landslide and implement winterization measures. The council also extended the local emergency declarations that were put in place to bolster the city's response to the landslide and utility shutoffs that have impacted hundreds of residents. For more information on the landslide and resources available, log on to rpvca.gov slash landmovement. As for other matters, the council considered an ordinance amending the city code to increase the number of cats and dogs allowed on a residential lot. Code change would increase the number of cats from three to five and dogs from three to four and is consistent with LA County code provisions. The ordinance could result in more pets being adopted and will go before the council in October for final consideration. Meanwhile, in an effort to bring about more transparency and accessibility in government, the city council voted to support a resolution being presented at the 2024 Cal Cities General Assembly Conference taking place October 16th through 18th in Long Beach. The resolution would enhance transparency standards requiring state officials be subject to same rules imposed on local officials to increase oversight and allow equal treatment for all government officials at all levels. Governor and legislature have passed laws that apply to local governments and not the state. For more details on all the issues before the City Council, watch the meeting on RPV TV, YouTube, and on the city's website at rpvca.gov. Let's stay connected and remember, we are RPV together.